How to avoid getting fat. It's all about the calories. Reduce your calorie consumption by not eating candies, cakes, pies, commercially packaged fruit juices, and soft drinks, which are typically high in refined sugars. Your body quickly turns these sugars into glucose, which it stores as body fat, particularly if you lead a sedentary lifestyle. Replace these items with low sugar or sugar-free versions. Make high fiber foods part of your daily food intake to help lower glucose levels in your bloodstream and to stop your body from storing fat. Cupcakes. Currently, cupcakes are very popular, but they pack 200 calories for a 1.5 ounce cupcake. Almost half of the calories are from saturated fat and that's a fact. They look small and innocent, but they're not. You need to either walk 55 minutes, jog 23 minutes, swim 17 minutes, cycle 31 minutes to lose one little cupcake. Avoid them. Coca-Cola. One 12 ounce can equals 143 calories. No fat, but do you need all that gas? Stop drinking your calories. We recommend drinking calorie-free green iced tea. No gas, plus you get the cancer-fighting benefits of green tea. Fried chicken. KFC, original recipe chicken breast with skin and breading. My favorite. Without the side dishes. The problem here is the fat. Of the 360 calories, 189 are from fat. It is 25% of our daily value of fat for the day. Ouch. Pizza. 14 inch pizza, pepperoni typing, topping, regular crust, 298 calories. Of course, we have to have at least two slices. That equals 596 calories. To burn 298 calories, you need to either walk 83 minutes jog 34 minutes, swim 25 minutes, cycle 45 minutes. Think about that the next time you eat pizza. Oh. Hot dog. Regular hot dog with bun. 325 calories. And of course, we always have two. To burn 325 calories, you need to either walk 87 minutes, jog 36 minutes, swim 26 minutes, Cycle 48 minutes. Try to only eat one. Good luck with that. Hamburger. McDonald's Big Mac Burger. 550 calories. To burn 550 calories, you, neither, you either have to walk 153 minutes, jog 63 minutes, swim 46, cycle 84 minutes. I'm getting tired just reading this. Two of them would equal 1,200 calories. Think about that the next time you're in McDonald's. Potato chips. One ounce package, 160 calories. We think we have never seen a one, inch pa one ounce package of chips or been able to stop eating them till the bag was gone. The real problem with chips is the amount of saturated fat due to frying. If you are going to eat chips, Buy the baked ones. They have less calories and fat. Nuts. Nuts are good for your overall health, but are bad for your waistline if you eat them by the handful. You can control the amount you eat by eating them only in your dinner salad. Grilled chicken wrap. 270 calories of which 108 are from fat. It is still a better choice than hamburgers or pizza. You need to either walk 75 minutes, jog 31 minutes, swim 22 minutes, cycle 41 minutes. French fries, 267 calories, but 50% is fat. Worse is the fact that it is saturated fat. Fried foods of any kind are bad. Eating fries is just as bad for your waist as potato chips. Fries are linked to the greatest weight gain. Milkshakes, 558 calories in a small 12 ounce shake. 
112 calories are from fat, 10.1 grams of saturated fat, plus it has trans fat, not good. Lunch. Let me just put this part in, John, because I wanted to share my personal experience. In the old days, I had this lunch at least once a week. Keep in mind, I also had a breakfast and a dinner. God only knows how many calories I was taking it in a day. I never knew how I got fat. Now I know, and so should you. I had a Big Mac, which was 550 calories, large french fries, which was 534 calories, a milkshake, which was 550 calories, for a total of 1,634 calories just for lunch. Imagine if I had 1,600 calories for dinner and maybe a 800 calorie breakfast, and I wondered where the fat was coming from. Well, what about you? Where's your fat coming from? Saturday morning diet works. Obesity doesn't have to be a problem in your life anymore. If you make an honest effort to eliminate bad habits, eat right, and exercise regularly, go to our website, joanbars.com, where we give you our meal replacement recipe for free and a 10-page weight loss report for subscribing. We also offer our three low-cost weight loss e-course packages at SaturdayDiet.com. New Referral Program We have created a new referral program where you can earn points towards wonderful prizes for referring our program to your friends and family when you subscribe to our email list. Subscribe today. Need help? Go to our website, joanbarth.com, by clicking the link below in the description and click the link, Start Here. Go to our joanbarth.com forum to ask your questions of others. Order one of our weight loss packages at saturdaydiet.com or click the link in the description below. Write us at saturdaydiet at gmail.com. Click link below to go to our video page on joanbarth.com where we have over 340 tutorial videos, or click here to subscribe to our channel. Please like us on Facebook, Facebook slash Saturday Diet. Get your free protein meal replacement recipe and 10-page free weight loss report ebook by subscribing to our blog by clicking the link below at joanbarth.com or write us at saturdaydiet at gmail.com. Get your copy of our weight loss ebook course. We've put together three separate packages to give you many different benefits and choices. Go to SaturdayDiet.com or click the link below to SaturdayDiet.com. Do you feel alone in your struggle to lose weight? Do you feel do you need encouragement and personal support so you can achieve success? We now offer our one-on-one -on -one weight loss coaching. Click the link below to go to joanbarth.com coaching.